everyone. So today's video is basically about a TV show. I used to do these like recaps for Pretty Little Liars, but that's not on air right now. So yeah, I think it's coming back like January or something. I don't know. But basically, the reason that I wanted to do this video is because I'm kind of I ha I'm having issues with this show and I really like it so it the show is revenge it's probably gonna be in the title somewhere um and I was caught up all up until the third season so I needed to watch the third season and whatever was on air for the fourth season so basically I got really really sick and I was in bed for like a whole week I like did not do anything didn't go to school didn't go to work nothing I was like in bed the whole time um and my sister as amazing as she is was with me the whole time that I was sick so basically we like been watched it like it was horrible we like spent like all night watching the show and we finished all of third season and we I like paid like on YouTube for like the fourth season and uh, we watched the, we got caught up in everything and first off let me tell you something that really caught me off guard well not off guard I kind of my sister kind of thought that was gonna happen but we didn't know for sure it was that Aiden died that was extremely disappointing just because it is he was one of my favorite characters actually he was my only character that I liked well I like Nolan too I think he's great but I had a thing for Aiden. I loved him. He was so hot. And then you kill the only hot guy in the show. That's really annoying. So that was... It made me feel a type of way, honestly. It just... It made me feel like I, I was not that interested in watching the fourth season after that finale. It was just like... Wait, what? Like... He was like the James Bond of the show. And then he was going to do something dumb and drink the tea. Come on now. He's smarter than that. So that was annoying. Like I said, it was kind of disappointed. Um, I didn't want to really watch the fourth season after that. But we still did. Um, okay. So basically in the fourth season, well, in the finale when Aiden dies, after that you see that David Clark is still alive. Which... I guess it was surprising, but it wasn't something that I really wanted, just because I felt like the writers of the show ran out of people for Emily to take revenge on. And they're like, okay, what we do? Bring David back. That's how it felt to me. I'm probably crazy, but that's kind of what I thought. So basically, David Clark's alive, and he is well, and he is kind of, I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know if it's the actor or something, but he has issues, like, it's not fun to watch him. He makes me nervous, but anyways, the whole issue that I have is David is back. He knows that Emily is Amanda now. Totally brushes off the fact that Victoria knew all along that Emily was Amanda and put him against Emily. Like, oh honey, you've been electrocuted. That that don't matter. Who is who's writing these episodes? Like that is just ridiculous. How are you gonna prefer this lady that betrayed you, put you in jail, and you're with her? And your daughter's like, oh, you know, his daughter can't have babies now. She killed the love of her life. And the dad's like, yeah, well, eh. I just don't understand this. And it's really annoying me. My biggest question is, is David acting all this up because eventually he's going to take revenge on Victoria by making her fall in love with him? That can be cool. But if his feelings are, like, genuinely real for this lady, bye. Because I'm done with that. No. I don't understand this. Can someone please explain this to me? Also, um, I'm really glad that Charlotte got sent to rehab because I don't like that character. Never have. Never will. She annoys me. Um, 
yeah, that character is done. Also, Jack, that he's a police officer now. That was a little too much. Um, kind of unnecessary, I think. Um, also, his partner, the other cop who was trying to get at Emily, and I see in the promos for next Sunday, or this Sunday, that they're like on a date together or something. He is not Aiden. We don't want him. Well, I, I don't want him. Like, no. He's not a replacement for Aiden. Like, let's just get that clear. So, I don't know what I'm really feeling towards that show anymore. It's kind of annoying me. So, that's that. Anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!